I got into a heated argument with the snowman. He lost his cool and had a total meltdown. <laughs> Right, so hello again everybody and welcome back. A lot of people have been getting in touch and messaging asking how they can get Discovery Plus on their device. So as you can see, I'm not in the US, I'm in the UK. I've got Discovery Plus on my device and I'm going to show you how you can get it on yours. Right, so that being said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let's crack on. Right, so I'm going to start by saying the Disney Plus app that you can see installed on my device, it's a 4K Fire Stick, it's pretty much useless. But I am going to show you how you can get Disney Plus on your device. It's a better way and it actually works. In some regions, you will be able to go to the Amazon store and type in Discovery Plus. So as you can see underneath there, it says Discovery Plus. And for me, it's not available. But I've got Discovery Plus and I want to watch it. And I want to watch it on my streaming device. So how do I do it? Well, this is where some people have been saying to get this app here. It is available on my website, letscrackon.org, where you can go and get it and try it yourself. But for me, if you open it, you're going to need to use a VPN. So you're going to need to connect to a US server for it to work. And not everybody's got a VPN. And also, when I did connect to a US server, I did find that I couldn't even log in. So I'm going to show you a better way to do this. And it's using, it says internet, it's probably already installed on your device. If it's not already, it's called Silk Browser. So if I just go up here and type in Silk, you can see Silk Browser there. Go ahead and download that. What this is, it's a web browser. We can open it up. So as you can see, it loads up. I've already signed in. And what you can do is click on Add Bookmark. And then if you go to the menu in the middle there, it will always stay there. So whenever you open Silk Browser, you can go to that menu, click on that bookmark. It'll take you straight through to that website where you are signed in. And then this American detective thing, honestly, I find myself watching these on, I think it's the Crime Channel. And then if I go and click on something, click on play. And once you've clicked on play, it's going to come up like this. You can click on play again. Or first of all, I'm going to go full screen. Well, second of all, <laughs> turn that down. And as you can see, full quality and it's working great. And then if you ever want to go back to the home page of Discovery Plus, you can click on this icon up here. It'll take you back there. You can do your searches, anything like that. And you can watch it freely, just like you would inside any app. I know a lot of people will be saying, I'd rather have a Discovery Plus app. But me in the UK, getting the Discovery Plus app means I have to sideload it. I have to use a VPN. And then the logins weren't even registering. Another good tip that you can use with Silk Browser as well is if I go to the Amazon store and I type in bookmark, I'm going to click on where it says bookmarker one, as you can see there. And you can get numerous different bookmarkers as well, but I'm going to download and install bookmarker one to my device. Simply clicking on the downward arrow there, get this app or get whatever it said. I can't remember. I didn't see it. I do apologize. <laughs> Once it's finished, I'm going to open up Bookmarker 1. And this is going to act like an application. And at the top, you can see, enter the URL you would like to automatically load in the web browser when this app launches. So I've typed in discoveryplus.co.uk. You will have to type it in for the region you're in. So if you're in the US or something, I'm guessing it's .com. If you're in India, I think it's .in. So for me, it's .co.uk, and I'm going to click on Next. Always open with Silk Browser. I'm going to leave that checked. Save the setting. And it does say, to start using your bookmarker, select this button to exit. I think it's just telling me it's available to start. So I'm going to click on the Home button, and it does show as a number one. So it does show it is like you're opening an application. If I click on one, you're going to see it chucks me straight into Discovery Plus. So you haven't got to type in the URL. It takes you straight there every time. And then once again, you can access that content you want to go on. Works exactly the same. Once again, I'm going to click on play on something. And then if we click on play, there you go, ding dangly do. Now, I know this is not really a Discovery Plus app. But this is the best method I've found for using it on a device in the UK. Dependent on device, on the 4K Fire Stick, it's not the fastest in the world. But once the content is playing, it plays absolutely fine. But do let me know down below your thoughts and opinions. And if you have installed that Discovery Plus app and you're from the UK, 
let me know how it's worked for you. So yeah, that's it. For those who wanted to know how to use Discovery Plus on your device in the UK, where you can't download it from the store, like on an Amazon device, that's how you do it, right? So that being said, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And I'll see you soon. Tara. If I just come down here, in some regions, you will be able to go to the Amazon search. So I'm... What? Now, I know a lot of people will be saying, well, I'd rather have an app. I'd rather... Yeah. <laughs>